let's learn to crochet with Daisy. In today's lesson, we will learn the moss stitch. The moss stitch is a very simple stitch that uses SC and chain. To begin the moss stitch, chain in multiples of two, one, 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 two. Now, to start the moss stitch, we're going to skip the first three chains and make a single crochet in the fourth chain from the hook. So one, two, three, and four. So I've made my first single crochet. Now chain one and skip one. So skip one and make a single crochet in the next stitch. Now chain one, skip one and make a single crochet in the next stitch. So keep repeating this all across, chain one, skip one and single crochet and I'll meet you at the end of this row. And I'm making a single crochet into the very last chain. So here's row one. Now to start row two, we're going to chain two and turn. Now here it is a single crochet, a chain one, a single crochet and a chain one. So we're going to skip the single crochet and work into the chain one space. So make a single crochet in the chain one space. Skip, I'm sorry, not skip, chain one and skip the next single crochet and make and I see in the next space. So for row two, we're going to chain one and single crochet in every chain one space. So chain one, single crochet in the next chain one space, chain one, single crochet in the next chain one space, chain one. Now we're at the end, so we're going to single crochet into the chain three space from the first three chains that we skipped in the beginning. So row 3 is exactly the same as row 2. So we will chain 2 and turn. Single crochet in the chain 1 space. Chain 1. Single crochet in the next chain 1 space. Chain 1. Single crochet in the next chain 1 space. Chain 1. Single crochet in the next chain 1 space. Chain 1. I've lost track of how many times I said chain one. So, chain one and single crochet in the chain two space at the end of the row. I'm going to make a couple more rows to show you how the pattern works up. So, chain two turn, single crochet in the chain one space, chain one. Single crochet in the chain one space, chain one. Single crochet in the chain one space, chain one. Single crochet in the chain one space, chain one. Single crochet in the chain one space, chain one. And keep doing that till you reach the end and single crochet into the chain two space in the end. I'll make two more rows and then stop. So this is how this stitch looks. Here's another one that I made earlier. So yes, you can see it's a very simple pattern that creates a beautiful texture. Both the sides look exactly the same. It kind of gives a knitted look, which is why a lot of people like this pattern. So keep practicing this stitch. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. 
and I will see you in the next lesson with another simple stitch. Happy hooking!